Hey guys, Marco Laturza here, eight-time international cover model from Switzerland. You are now joining me in the vegan project. So I'm now in my second week of being 100% vegan. So before I go into the vegan nutrients today, I want to explain why I'm doing this experiment. So I've been eating meat my whole life, so this is something I really like. But I read a lot about this upcoming vegan diet lifestyle that I decided myself to try this out to see the pros and cons, if it fits for me, um, just what I should think about the vegan diet. So after two weeks now, I feel really great, I must say. So what I feel is that my body has a lot of, or like a lot less acid. So since I stopped taking any kind of milk, meat, eggs, which cause the body to produce more acid. Um, I feel that the acid is like a whey, which results in better workouts. So it takes much more until I get sore when I train myself. This is a really good benefit now. And I also feel like due to less acid that is in my body, my recovery got a lot better. So the last two weeks have been really exciting to me in a positive way. So talking about the training, there's so far nothing negative. Also, my strength is like the same. I didn't feel any difference yet. We'll see the upcoming, upcoming weeks whether in my strength improves, whether it stays the same. I'm really curious myself to see that. Also, I want to point out that you should be careful now. This is the beginning phase of this vegan project. So it can be also due to the big change that I'm doing that my body is responding so positively. So I'm really curious now whether this change is sustainable. So I will be doing this project for at least a month, probably even longer, to see also like what's happening when I'm doing this vegan diet for a bit longer than uh, one month. So I'm really curious about that. So these are like the pros. There are also some cons, which I wanna tell you now. So generally cooking gets more difficult. Uh, it takes more time in the kitchen to do the meal prep because you're, using a lot of legumes and the legumes they you know you need to put it in water it takes much more preparation than with normal food this is something you need to consider also when you're going to eat outside i did the test already it gets more difficult the variety of restaurants is really limited and you exactly need to research before you go to a restaurant does it have vegan foods or not otherwise you're running into a problem so this is uh, so far about uh, the, the cons. Also, shopping gets more difficult. You need to go to special stores where you have the fake meat, which I will show you afterwards. So this is another thing you need to consider. And for myself, I had a protein powder or I tried a protein powder that um, caused allergies in me. So I had some skin itching on my um, forehead, which is now away because I did the test on my skin. So I rubbed a bit my skin put um, the protein powder on my skin and my skin started to react. So I did not support this protein powder. Also, if you turn vegan, don't do that from one day to another. Do that step by step because it's a big change. You are taking new nutrients which can cause allergies. So be careful there. So this is um, an update about the last two weeks of being vegan. And uh, yeah, you're welcome to join me now and see how it's going on. I'm out for today.